Hello everyone, um, my starting keys aren't really working that I use to get the things moving or starting, but I'm going to do a scratch tutorial. I'll teach you how to make games and all that fun stuff. So, for this game, I'll teach you how to just um, make a game. Um, you can use Scratch if you want, but I don't really use them. Um, just get rid of him like this. God. And I forget how to. I haven't used Scratch in a long time, so I'm not the best at it. Then we have the eraser tool. Uh, rub him out, make him bigger. Uh, okay, now we have a clean slate to work with. What I like to use for making new characters, I would normally use the line tool and then just line him up. I don't know if you say that. Um, crap. And there is this tool which lets you go back. So, uh, okay. So now I use this to just draw the character. I do fill in the little holes afterwards. Oh, this isn't working. I haven't used Scratch in a long time. My computer is broken. Um, and my voice is kind of gone. Well, if you haven't noticed, and I haven't done YouTube in a while, so well, I have done it. Like you, some of you might get what I mean. Um. Anyway, then we want to use the book tool. Peach. There's still a hole in him, any obviously, right here. Um, these are just the basics of creating a character. I'm on the wrong colour, but anyway. And now we have the head. I'll just do a simple little body now. Okay, I can't see my mouse. Okay, because we're using the wrong colour. Um, I'm gone kind of bad at scratch. I'll stick mine here. Now, that's a little smiley face on my feet. Uh, Darpy little smile. Give him some glasses. These are very bad looking glasses. Put the little connection thing over there. This is like. I don't know. <laughs> and there you go, you have a little man. So now, we can code this little man to m he could follow your mouse or anything like that. I'll just make him follow your mouse because that's the easiest thing to do. Go to the mouse pointer. Now when you click the thingy go button. Not saying please. I forget how to fix this. Um, forever. That's the key I need. Or actually, yeah. You when you're using when green flag is clicked, you always have to use forever. Unless you don't want it to happen forever. Now you have your little man that moves around. So now. Can do the backdrop. What could my backdrop be? Why not have a pig? And 
There you go, you have your perfect little back. You can customize perfect as much as you want. Make a big Hitler if you want as well. Perfectly fine with that. Do whatever you want with her. Okay, just colour in. Do pick. Make pick, pick Hitler. What'll this video be titled? How to make a Hitler Peppa Pig. How to make Peppa Pig Hitler. No. And we can have a little man here waving at Peppa Pig. Hitler, Peppa Pig. Hail Hitler. I can draw a little flagpole holding up the, the best thing in the world. That is right. A swastika. So I want. This is a tutorial on how to make a swastika. Or Peppa Pig. Hitler. Peppa Pig. Uh. Think it was white. And write the swastika. A little circle. Now what we want to do, get the bucket tool, the red, there we go, and finish off the rest painting it. Um. <laughs> I know it doesn't look that good right now, but it will be amazing when it's done. Uh, uh, oh. It is annoying to do this, but it's funny. For the views. Uh, okay, I'll just leave it like that and then a little thing that we wanted. Now we can hail Hitler. Won't Uten go? Won't Uten? Oh, I can't speak German. And there you go. And save that. That'll be our thumbnail. Um. Goodbye, everyone.